Hey friends, Alvin here. Welcome to our October snapshot. At the beginning of October, we're hosting our Youth Pastors Retreat, an annual gathering. This time we're hosting at Camp Clawson. And so we're looking forward to this time of having a group of youth pastors together to share, to reconnect, to spend some time both individually and together looking at what does youth ministry mean in the coming months and coming years. And so that's a, that's a time of fellowship we're looking forward to. We are continuing with our Maximizing Ministry Gatherings. In October, we're going to get a chance to look at the Youth Canada findings based on the Barna study. What exactly does evangelism look like with Generation Z? Uh, we're actually going to have an opportunity to hear from Tim Gonzalez, who's part of Alpha Canada, and he'll help unpack uh, what that looks like. And then on October 26th at 7.30 p.m. or on Thursday, October 28th at 10 a.m., uh, we'll get a chance to gather together to dissect this, to dig it deeper in what this means, not just for the broader community, but also what it might mean for your ministry specifically. And so you can find out more details, including the video, at cboq.ca slash maxmin. We continue to make preparations for Avalanche and Blizzard going forward in January and February 22. Question is, what exactly does it look like? There are still a few details that we're still working out in October. But late October, we're hoping to release our registration package. We'll, de we'll specify exactly what we're planning to do and how you can participate. So we encourage you to look out for that at cboq.ca slash avalanche or cboq.ca slash blizzard. What we are definitely continuing on is our Slingshot and Team Captain programs. Both of these are separate opportunities for some of your youth and young adults to take the next step in their ministry development. With Slingshots, they can be looking at areas of either event management, uh, communication, or public speaking. And with Team Captains, it's an opportunity to understand and lead a large group of people, both potentially online and in person. And so we invite uh, all your youth and young adults who are interested to be applying for either a slingshot or team captain application. Applications are available at cblq.ca slash slingshot or cblq.ca slash team captain. Both of those are due at the end of the month on October 31st. Speaking of October 31st, this is a time of year where many of our youth ministries serve their neighborhoods and communities. And so we're curious what you might have planned for this coming year and this month. And so whether you want to share this through Facebook, on our Facebook page, whether it's through Twitter or Instagram, maybe you can message me directly with your details, and we would love to share it on your behalf to see what are some of the different ways that you're serving your community at the end of this month. We know for the last few months, some of you have been feeling pretty stressed. It's been a tough time for you. For some of you, maybe it's things that are happening with your own families, maybe in your church, maybe in other areas of your life. And so we recognize that while ministering to youth is a great calling, we know it's not your only calling. We know that there are many things that God has called you to, and maybe in some, a lot of ways, God is reminding you of. And so over the next few weeks, Matt Wilkinson, our Director of Next Generation Ministries, and myself, we're going to be contacting all of our youth leaders directly, uh, whether it's through text, through email, through a phone call, or something else. We would love to connect with you just to see how you're doing just to hear what you're going through, just to pray alongside you as well. And so you can be awaiting one of us to contact you, or if you like, you can reach out to me directly. And I would love to make some space to talk with you, whether it's by phone, through Zoom, and in some cases, maybe even in person. And so looking forward to different ways how we can be supporting you as God is ministering, not just through you, but in you as well. And so blessings to you as you continue to walk in the steps of Jesus as he made available through his death and resurrection. And so blessings to you.